Greetings, Crewage here. So we're finally back into Red Dead Online. So we finally came out of beta, and I'm trying to give it a chance to see what's going to go on with it. So, first thing I'm going to do is we got this new mission. So I'm going to head over that way. Damn, I didn't realize I was that far away from it. It's all the way on the other side of the map. Oh well, that's going to be a journey. Let's see what else. Anything else? Nope. Looks like that's the only one so far. Why is my camp so far up there? Man, I can, I'm pretty sure I remember my camp being in New Austin. I don't know. It's been a while since I played. But anywho, let's head there. All right, so call my horse in. And we'll get this started up. Gotta remember how to play this game. It's been a while since I've been doing this. I've been playing so much Destiny because this game was in beta. I was just waiting for everything. Why can't I change my guns? Hmm. I wonder what's up with that. Well, let me change my gun. That's stupid. What the hell's the matter with my guns? Ah, oh, yeah. They're on the horse. Oh my god, I forgot about that. I'm an idiot. Uh, you can tell I haven't played this in a while. Okay, but anyway. Let's head down yonder road. See what's up. First, you know what? Let's go by the camp, because it said I got packages to pick up. Let's go by there and see what we can get. Rockstar gave me a bunch of stuff when I was signing in. Got some gold and some cash and... Said it gifted me some other stuff. Alright. What is that? Got ourselves a bar. No, I ain't even messing with it. All of my guns are so weak right now. All I do is just ruin the pelt. So let's get out of here. Ooh, traveled 50 miles by horse. Alright. So at least camp was close. kind of really like to have just my own place, like a homestead, like you do at the end of story mode. I kind of like to start that up and go ahead and have that in the works, instead of having to deal with these stupid camps. Because I am not upgrading anything with him. I don't care. I don't care what it is. I might upgrade the tent, but he doesn't get anything. Alright, let's see what's in the box. What's in the box? It won't let me get anything. What is up with this? It just told me I had parcels. That's the wrong button. Let's see. Give me it. Yeah. Oh, that didn't work. Okay, so apparently I don't have anything here. So, what I'm going to do now is pull out the old catalog. And we have a new weapon. I don't want to check out. I got some gold burning a hole in my pocket. Let's see what this thing is. This is the Lamat revolver. Because it's a grape shot revolver and a single action. So it looks like that's gonna be kind of like a shotgun and a pistol at the same time kind of deal. I don't know, I'm gonna buy it. If I can buy it with gold. Everything else is ranked up, so well, I got that. I want the volcanic pistol. Can't have that yet because I'm not high enough rank, which is stupid. The prices, man, these prices are still high. But, yeah, I think I'm going to get that. I don't want the shotgun. It really wasn't that great of a weapon in story mode, so I care not. I am going to buy that. 13 gold. Cool. I definitely got to go to the gunsmith and get my weapons adjusted. Alright. So, I guess now we'll head on and do that mission. Get that taken care of. So, get that. Let's see how that works. That's set there. 
Trying to get all my weapons set up, so I don't have to deal with that. I want the Evans repeater. I got that a while back. I haven't even really used it yet. I don't even think I've even fired it at anything that wasn't not an animal. Wasn't an animal. Whatever I just said. I don't know. Oh yeah, I forgot we gotta buy binoculars. So let's check this thing. So that's pistol version. You hold right on the D-pad while aiming to switch between shotgun and revolver firing modes. Okay. So that's regular. That's shotgun. That's cool. It probably has no range, but that's pretty cool. Awesome. Cool beans. Ooh, new daily challenges. Alright, I think I'm gonna leave it on shotgun. Alright, so now let's go take care of that thing. Actually, you know what? I still have a treasure map that I have not done. Where is that? Barge crossing. There it is. There is a treasure map thing over there. I forgot I had that. So let's go do that first. That could be cool. Still hitting all the wrong buttons because I'm not used to this thing yet. Alright, let's go in here before I leave camp. So there's a new online option. Yeah, no. I just want that on friends only. That's fine. I don't know. Walking gap. Defensive. Alright. So we're going to see how this does. It prevents lock on, reduces damage taken from other players, missions without player, conflict, are prioritized. Requires low or medium hostility. Well, I'm pretty low hostility, so this shouldn't be a problem. My blip is only visible at a short range. Cool. Defense will be available in 30 seconds. Oh, so you gotta wait for it to come active. Alright, cool. So let's mosey on down that way and make some gold. Or find some gold or whatever it is that we're gonna find over here. Should be pretty cool. Yeah, of course that's the way we're gonna start this off. My poor horse. I'm sorry, Cinnamon. Oh, no, I, my defensive just uh, and acted, became enabled, whatever you want to call it. All right. So now let's go do some stuff. I'm going to wait and do hunting once I get my weapons all upgraded because they're basically just still basic. I've done a little bit of upgrading, but... I need to upgrade with the barrels and sights and all that stuff, so pretty much waiting to do that. That way I don't take a chance on ruining. Plus I'm waiting on unlocking the Springfield rifle, which is my favorite for hunting. That's actually one of my favorite rifles anyways, but it's really good for hunting. The bolt action's cool, but I just don't like the way it fires. It's kind of weird. Hey, watch it, buddy. Oh, I went the wrong way. So far it seems pretty cool. It's pretty much the same thing as it was before. I don't see any red dots on the map. So either everybody's really cool or there's just no abusive type players in here. It's pretty late too. It's just got off work. It's about 11 o'clock at night. So I don't know how many people be playing this late. But hopefully if everything goes well. We're supposed to get a big DLC this spring. Maybe we'll get some houses and property and stuff like that. So, I mean, the camps are cool. You can move them around. You can be here and there, and you have a safe spot somewhere on the map. But I'm, I'm ready to start building up my empire, however I'm going to do it. It's you know, pretty much what I did in GTA Online. It's what I want to do on here. Hopefully, they'll follow some of the same things that they did in GTA Online in here. I mean, I know the reason why they didn't do a lot of it, because they would to be people would just be like, oh man, you're still, you're just doing copy GTA, you didn't come up with anything new. But, I mean, when you have a billion dollar success, like GTA Online was, why vary off of that? I mean, that's, that's a pretty good basic setup. 
make a couple billion dollars off of it. Now, that's an award-winning way to do stuff. I don't know, that's the way I see it. But I can understand why some people are complaining about this being too empty. Oh, spoke too soon. Bad guys. Oh. oh, my guns suck. Oh, why'd I shoot that horse? I locked onto that horse. Poor horse. Oh, it's laying over there hurt. That sucks. What am I using? I think I'm using a 22. This is actually a pretty decent weapon. The only problem is it's, it really doesn't have any range. Well, especially right now because mine's just as basic as it can be. But you can fire it pretty fast, what I like. Get him with a headshot works real good too. There's a bunch of these guys. Yeah, I like how they did this. I like having player versus environment stuff show up. Ooh, I stung him. Oh man, I'm just, just pumping holes in this dude, not doing any damage. Oh, there we go. I finally got him. I must have hit him in something vital. That guy's shooting me. It's time to get the real gun out. I gotta get in my settings. This is all weird. That guy go. Ooh, that bullet went right over my head. This Evans repeater is pretty cool. I can't wait to upgrade it. Let me try this thing here. Oh yeah, I like that. Let's see if we can get some distant shots. Oh, missed him. Oh, got them that time. Ooh, somebody shoot me. Good shot. All right. Let's go start looting some of these guys. Oh, which button do I hit to do that? Oh, there it is. Hit triangle. Okay. Ow, somebody shot me. How did that come from? Oh, I see it. Gotcha. Cool. I'm not going to loot all these guys because one thing I've learned about is a lot of gunfire brings other players. So, I'll get these real quick and then I'm going to get on down the road. There's no sense for other people to show up and start taking stuff. Or attacking me. My character is so weak right now, he can barely do anything. I think I'm in level 10. So I got about that far, and I put it up till it came out of beta. Alright. Cool. I ain't worried about them other guys. I'm not going to get that much off of them anyways. Story mode, you can fill up your satchel with it. It's online. You're lucky to get a dollar out of 50 people. All right, so that was pretty cool. Love those little surprise ambush deals like that. But like I was saying, uh, a lot of people are complaining because this game is so empty. And one of the things that I think they should have done is they should have put a lot more little villages and stuff like that in the game, little camps and stuff like that. Just, I know they tried to make it realistic, but you know, it's not going to be realistic for long, so you might as well just go ahead and get used to it. Because I'm waiting for the Gatlin gun to come out. It'll be on something. It'll probably be on a wagon or then there'll be some type of machine gun that you can have and it'll completely change the dynamics of the game. Just like GTA, they always, you know, they'll give you something that completely turns into a Griefing tool. Man, there's a lot of horses. I don't remember there being this many horses out running around when it was in beta. I still got this one. I need to go get me one. Go actually get some more stable space. I haven't messed with that at all. 
I'll have to do that too. Add that to the list. So we have to get to the stables, go to the gun store. Got a bunch of stuff to do. But just getting used to doing this again. I always forget that I can go faster on the horse too. It's just like I'm going for a leisurely jog. It'd take me forever to get there if I do it like that. I haven't seen a single player yet either. That's pretty cool. Alright. Oh, nope. I just saw a blue dot. Right as I was pulling that up. What am I doing? Go to the satchel. Stop this. There we go. I know the map's in here somewhere. There we go. Oh, search all of that area. That that should be easy to find. That's only like what? 20 square miles? It's a pretty vague treasure map. It should be just like, just go west and look under stuff. Alright. So we're going to head this way. Go find some treasure. Now I did see somebody over here a minute ago. I guess they're gone. Oh well. This is pretty cool. One of the things I really like about this game is, you know, just the slowed down riding of the horse. It's kind of like riding a, a motorcycle in GTA Online. You just take your time and just chill out and cruise around. It doesn't make for an exciting video, but that's pretty much how this is going to go. Because so I definitely want to get up enough money to... Get a Turkomon horse. I dig those. I can't find one in the wild. I don't know if you can find one of those. Probably not. Probably just be Morgans and stuff. Which a Morgan is a good horse. I got a cousin has got a couple of them on his farm. They're good horses. Well, I was kind of surprised to see how low they put him on as the ranking in the game. I mean, I know it's not a race horse, but it's still, that's a good horse. I mean, I've never really run into a crap horse. Is there even such thing as a horse that's just crap? I mean, I mean those are pretty much what donkeys are. It's kind of a, you know, crap horse. But donkeys are cool too, I mean, I guess. If you know. That's what you need is a donkey. I wonder why we don't have them in the game to like own. Cause that'd be pretty cool. I'd like to ride around on a donkey. Just have them making all kinds of noise and stuff. Or they can't. I wonder if they'll do them like pack mules. It's where they can carry stuff. That's what they should have done for the hunting thing. So you just pick up a pack mule and take them with you while you go hunting. And then you can just put a whole bunch of skins on that. Because trying to deal with another horse is kind of weird. Because it needs to be set up kind of like a trailer on your vehicle. Or your horse. I don't know. There's somebody right there. Heading the other way. It's pretty cool. Nobody's messed with me so far. I mean, the first time that I... It was a couple times back that I played. As soon as I came into the lobby, they killed my horse, shot me, and then I just kept killing me as soon as I respawned. They, re they spawn killed me like 10 times in a row. And I was just like, well, this game sucks. Because <laughs> I think back then I was a level 5 or something. I just had a pistol. Deeds were riding up on me with, you know, whatever they had. Instant death. 
course it's gonna rain. It I think the, the the whoever does the graphics for rain for Rockstar like has it in their contract that it must rain so many times in the game. Because they're like, yeah, you gotta you gotta show it off. It looks awesome, but it's gotta happen at least twenty times in an hour. Man, this is a long... Okay, cool. We're almost here. I was about to say, man, this is a long ride. So let's head over this way. Let's see what we can see. Use Eagle Eye to find the treasure chest. Oh, my horse won't stop. Oh, man, I forgot what button it was. Oh, hopefully I can get this before he runs off the edge. Okay, whoa. There we go. Horse is scared of the thunder. Alright, so after a few minutes, I had to go online and try to find the locations of these because I spent like 30 minutes trying to find them. I can't find anything. So I did find a website that had hints. So I'm coming over here and I'm going to see. If I can find this box. Because apparently there's a lock box. There's like three of them or something like that. Alright. So I am in the general location. Let's see if I can find this thing. Yeah, I didn't think it was going to be right out in the open. All right, so it looks like we're jumping down off the cliff. Just shattered one of my ankles. Still don't see it. I rode down over here too. I didn't see it when I rode in here on the horse. Hmm. This is poopy. I wonder if it's got to be a certain time of day. Oh, nope. There it is. I just seen it. There it is right there. All right, let's see what we get. Oh, man, there ain't nothing in it. That's stupid. I did all that searching. There's nothing in it. All right, now I gotta go hunt down this thing at the other location. So let me go get my horse. Well, I gotta go down to where the little island thing is out in the sand by the water. All right, so let's head down here. Hopefully I get a good bit of treasure. I don't think I will. I mean, this is your first treasure map, so. Hopefully it'll just give me some stuff. Whoa, I almost rode off that. At least I'll get some cool stuff. It's a lot further than I thought it was. See, these things are spread out. How are you supposed to find these without going to the internet and cheating? Just gonna wander around until you finally find it? It's a pretty vague map there at Rockstar. Still don't see anything. You probably have to be within like 10 feet to do this to see it. I think there's something right there. Yep, there it is. All right. Let's see what we're going to get. This one's empty. I got to go one other place that's back up on top of the hill. Nope, got something. I think it's a gold bar. Cool. Oh, I got a dollar forty-one. Open health cure. Five rifle cartridges. Fifty-six dollars. A nugget buckle. 
500 XP. Why not just give me the $500 I would have gotten for the gold bar and let me do whatever I want to do with it? Man. Rockstar ripping you off. Gave me 50 bucks instead of 500. Alright, so let's get the guns out. What is that? Oh, it's just a gray fox. Alright, so let's go head over to that spot where that mission was. We'll get that started up. Now, where am I going? This isn't where I need to go. I need to go this way. Alright, hold on. Set this location. Right there. Cool. Oh, mark it. This controller is messing up bad. I'm gonna have to take it apart and fiddle with it. All right, get a weapon out. This isn't so much for bad guys. This is more for mountain lions and wolves. Cause my horse is a skitty, scaredish little. I don't know. And just second a wolf comes running out, it throws me right on the ground. So hopefully. I can get the drop on it before it gets me. So I'm not too worried about other players. So I think pretty much all the other players are doing the same thing I'm doing. Just trying to play the game. It's a shame that you got, you know, just dicks that just want to go in and just ruin it for other people. I'm just waiting for wolves to come running out of somewhere. Hmm. That would have been a perfect spot back there, too. Let's mosey on down this road a little faster. See, right here'd be a good spot too. Alright. Let's eat some game, get my health up, before we start this mission. Whoa, that train was a lot closer than I thought it was. Oh, I got a player coming right at me. Oh, he's just going the other way. Cool. Later, dude. Can't really complain about that. I tried driving, uh, riding the horse in first person, but it shakes the camera so much it makes me seasick, like car sick. It's kind of weird. I wish there was a way to make it not like that because my eyes, I've ridden a horse before and my head doesn't shake like that. Your eyes will stabilize the bounce. So they don't need to put that in the game. Alright, so I'm here. Go. Cool. Let's start up this mission. See what happens. I have no idea. I've never even played it. See, I would love to do this mission by myself, but of course it's multiplayer. Well, that's a fine bunch of proper villains. Except for that one dude in the vest. I don't know. I don't trust him. He looks shady. I mean, we all look shady, but he looks more shady. Even shadier. Ah, there you are. And alive and flourishing, I see. You weren't wrong, Horley. These bastards know how to fight. I believe so. Now, my mistress wanted me to thank you for your attention to her business. I'm sure there'll be more, but for now, goodbye. And good luck. If luck is what you need. My friends, we're nearly ready. Just one more thing. We're going to need an express company stagecoach. An express company stagecoach and some uniforms. There's a stage outside the jail in Strawberry, and there'll be some uniforms and a supply wagon out on the road nearby. You all go do that, and I'll go get some supplies, and we'll meet back here. It don't take too long. Don't tell me what to do. Take as much time as I want. All right, let's get my horse. So we got to go to Strawberry or Great Plains. 
Bill's going to help me carry it out. All right, so two of us should go to one and two of us should go to the other. And a wagon with some uniforms in it that's going through the great So of course everybody's going to ride to the one spot. Nah, I'm not doing that. No sense in all three of us, right? All four of us riding over to the one thing. I'm going to get the other thing. Stagecoach. See, you got two people go one way, two people go the other way. You meet back in the middle. Everything's good. And if I was doing this solo, I'd do them one after the other like that, but... No way to reason to do that. Wish it was daytime. Damn. Seems like I'm always recording at night. Horses get tired. Oh, it looks like there's a bunch of bad guys up here. All right. So let's sneak on up in here and try to find a stagecoach. Ooh, stamina increased. Level 9. What the hell am I doing? Wrong button. What is up? Why is my stamina gone? Oh, I'm cold. And I don't have any damn cold weather clothes. I need to buy some. Add that to the list too. Gun store, clothes, stable. There's a bunch of these guys. I gotta get all the way over to where the sheriff's office is. Let's see if I can jump down on this roof. Oh, what the hell? Well, no, it worked, so can't complain. Eat something real quick. If that'll bring. Damn it, I keep hitting the wrong button. Here we go. Okay, cool. That brought my stamina back up. It's not going to last long, but... Give me a little bit. So I think I'm going to have to fight my way out of this. So I don't see a way to get across over there. Yep. One down. Oh, oh, he's too far. Are you kidding me? Three shots from that distance? Uh, there's a lot of people. See, you're dead now. A good spot right here. Man, this gun is weak as hell. I shot three people and didn't kill a single one of them. Got them that time. This dude over here. Oh, there goes the stage cut. Well. Now for this nonsense, excuse me sir, I'm going to need to steal this horse. Could you please stop shooting at me? Alright, shooting my horse, this isn't even my horse. Ride, horse! Alright, so let's go catch this stagecoach. This will be a lot easier than having to deal with that in there. I am wanted dead or alive. Let me shoot these guys. Oh, are you kidding me? Every time I get a red dot, it bounces. Hmm. Oh yeah, jump off the horse. That works. Get on the horse, you idiot. And I got guys show. Hey, that dude. I think that's the great grandfather of that dude that's from GTA Online. I hear him yell all the time. Now I got one of them. Lucky tree stopped you. Oh my lord. Get off it. Oh my. That's it. Yep. This is the luckiest dude in this state. Yep. His luck ran out. That's a dude trying to shoot me. Quit trying to shoot me. There you go. I'll go bleed to death. Come on. 
Get up here and get these two idiots off the thing. Why is this taking so long? Come on. Now I got more people on me. No, you need to stop shooting me. And I need to find a road. Oh, this is not good. This is not the type of vehicle. Aw, oh, look at me. Stop shooting me. Another guy coming up on me. I'm kind of glad nobody else is with me so they see how bad that I'm screwing this up. I mean, this ain't too bad for my first time ever doing this. At least I did it. And here's the other guys. Oh shit, sorry dude. I didn't mean to hit you. <laughs> That's my bad. That was totally my bad. Come on, horse, get up. We're gonna have to cut you loose. Who's shooting me? Damn. Every time I turn around, somebody's shooting me. Some bandit. Y'all can fire your guns, you know. I'm a little busy right here trying to do something. I got it. If I get hit by a butterfly, I'm dead. Trying to drive, kill people. I got that guy. That was pretty awesome. Hey, you think you can get that dude to keep shooting me? There we go. Now you got it. Alright, cool. We pretty much got this under control. As long as nothing crazy shows up. Or anything ridiculous. We should have this in the bag. I wish it told me how far away I was. Oh, we're right here. Cool. Well, that was easy. That wasn't too bad of a mission at all. Well, well. Looks like everything we need. Here comes the horses. Cool. Why did it show me get off the thing twice? I was already off and then it showed me get Okay. This game. But cool. At least we finished this one up. Alright. Well, this is a Great Witch. I think that's where I'm going to stop this video for today. And we'll pick it back up right here next time. Alright. This is Great Witch. I'll see you next time. Peace!